Mm. Sit back. Right. right, now we're back. We've got the bumblebee dress on, and I've just done a couple of bunches here. Sit down, darling. And I'm going to plait these and put some ribbons in. So, I'm just going to quickly plait these. And mum, you said. This end. Floor somewhere. Right. Yes, she went. Ah, Cindy Bear. I don't want any black bobbles, so these I have to do. I'm going to cover them up with yellow ribbons. They're pink. So, oops, I'll take just a yellow ribbon there. Tuck it in underneath. Like that. I'm going We're going to make a bow on these. A bow on there. Like that. Hello, Cindy. You're talking at me. You're tugging my foot. What does she mean? She's tugging on me. What do you mean by that? So it's just jumping up. <laughs> There's one. One with you. I'm going to put... One there. Spread them through. Those look quite pretty in. Yeah, because we have a dress, my stingy tail. Sure. Yeah. Okay. And I have my dress on as a bumblebee. And I got the bumblebee mask, so I might look like a bumblebee to the bees. So help the bees don't chase me. <laughs> Well, bumblebees don't chase you, do they? No. So there's three pretty little ribbons there. I'll do the other side now. Just a bit of there. A few years ago, I got stung by a bumblebee, but <coughs> so my sister, who must have been probably You said about, that on the other video, Mom. I know, but I'm just saying. Um, I was probably about <coughs> six or seven. My sister was probably... Um, about three. So um, she was down the bottom of the garden, waving her little arms around, scared of this bumblebee. But of course, the bumblebee was more scared of, scared of her than um, the other way round. And I thought I'd step in and try and save her from the bumblebee. And of course, I got stung, and the poor little bumblebee died. So saving that bumblebee yesterday was really lovely. It made up for the one that the. Um, sadly lost years ago. So if you can, try and plant as many flowers in the garden that attract bumblebees because they're going extinct and we learned about this at school, didn't we? Yeah. So, um, and I'll try and put some And we did the push of the bumblebees. What do I did? Um... I didn't do a bumblebee. No, it wasn't, was it? It was, um... Everybody I did the bumblebee. It was a little, um... Oh, gosh, what were they called? What are they called? It's like a mouse, but it's not a mouse. So what I'll do is I'll put a link on the website so you can actually see where to go to find out which flowers to plant to attract bumblebees into your garden. Remember that if a bumblebee buzzes near you, all you have to do is stand still and it will leave you alone. If it doesn't want you, it wants a flower. Did I do that? Don't do that, sweet. Okay. And we have loads of flowers in the garden. And what tracks bumblebees? And it tracks butterflies. Because it's up there. It's not that big bush plant where it's looking at up in there. But you can't see it. It's right up there. It's a butterfly plant. It's just kind of like a tree. And um, it tracks butterflies. And bees love blackberry bushes. So Try and plant a blackberry bush. Yeah, they do. They love blackberry bushes. So try and plant a blackberry bush. And then you can get bumblebees in the garden. 
But if you have flowers in blackberry, so it doesn't matter. And the great thing about blackberry bushes is that you can make blackberry fall, which is really, really nice. It's just made with cream, double cream and black, and uh, blackberries. And you mix it in. Don't you? Sugar, yeah. I've got the recipe on my blog. And if you go on there by Butterfly, it'll tell you all about it. On the blog, yeah. Which is on here. So there we have it. Let's take this off a minute. Bumble, bumble, go bumble, so here we have the finished bumblebee costume with the uh, face paint. Let's have a look at the face paint. Turn around. There, isn't that cute? <laughs> Can I send by the flowers then? There, that should look cute. Say bye-bye. Bye, bye, bye.